Disrupt New York Hackathon is over, and we are here with the winners, Alexa Site, or rather the team behind Alexa Site. Congratulations, guys. Thank you. Thank uh, you. So, for those of you who uh, haven't actually, you know, watched the whole stream, what is Alexa Site? Yeah, so Alexa Site is a way for uh, web designers to easily mock up ideas. So, if you're in a meeting with a client, right, you don't want to go to Photoshop to just, you know, mock out what a certain image might look like or something like that. Alexa Site allows you to just speak into Amazon Echo. Na um, narrate your design changes, and then they become live on your website. So when you say narrate, and then they become live on the website, what's actually happening there to, to make the that happen? End? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, Amazon has these really cool APIs that let you parse, um, you know, the input strings and let you parse out intents. And so with those intents, we're able to determine what types of changes you want and how to change it. So mm -hmm. the I think first one we did was aligning things to the cer certain sides. So we were able to parse out what side, and then also the intent behind that. People love the background photos, so you could just say, hey, my background should be like a carpenter because it's a carpenter business, so I just pulled up a beautiful carpenter photo and added it as a background to the website. Got it. Uh, so how, do you guys, did you guys come in knowing each other before, or did you form a team at the event? No, actually, it, it's funny. We met through mutual friends, and then we also met through mutual friends. So um, yeah, no, I had no clue what I was building until like 7 p.m. <laughs> so night. you met? Through mutual friends, but at the, it wasn't you rolled in solo basically. Rolled in solo basically, yeah. What do you, what made you guys think that you would be a good team together? Um, I think just you know hanging around, you know, all the way before 7 p.m. We realized you know we worked pretty well together. Yeah, um, we, all had similar, we all had similar friends, so it just made sense that we could actually work together, and we made a good team. Yeah. What do you guys do uh, when you're not at hackathons? Yeah, so I'm a web designer. Um, okay. So that's that's solving a real problem. Motivation for uh, that. Uh, I have a full-time job as a quant analyst. Yeah. And I'm a Python dev in the back end. Great. Um, and so is this something you think you'd continue working on? Yeah. I mean, I think it's an interesting uh, problem, and we've come up with an interesting solution. Um, there's some you know, challenges behind turning it from a hack into a real product, but I'd be open to looking into it. Uh, so you know, you guys are actually on stage uh, a couple times, right? Uh, <laughs> Twice. Uh, because there were some uh, technical issues. Um, yeah. what, what was going on there? Yeah. So uh, so the Wi-Fi on the stage didn't work. So we had to like tether it through my iPad, which was dying, um, and that didn't really connect on stage. That was the first problem. And then we tried it again with my phone, and it didn't work. So we just went with the command line input. Yeah. Did you feel? I mean, it must have. Been, I, I just feel like whenever I see people at the hackathon stage, it seems so stressful because it's such a compressed period of time. Yeah. It was. It rough. must have been pretty tough. It was. It was really rough. We we had this like super detailed pitch outline. And you know, as soon as Alexa didn't respond that first time, it just completely derailed us. So. Right. But then you, you went up and you, you nailed it. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, so I guess the last question is just if people think this is like a really interesting project and they want to follow it or you know see updates or maybe even help out potentially. Yeah. Uh, what can they do? Yeah. So um, for me, you can just go to chrisgrant.co or email me at chris at chrisgrant.co and I'll get back to you soon. I'm City Norman C I T Y Norman at Twitter. And I'm Dylan Co at DylanCo84 at Gmail. You can always email me out. Awesome. Well, congratulations again, guys, and uh, thanks for the microphone assist. <laughs> no problem. Thank you.